Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are doing good. Today, on the channel, we'll be looking at the final two figures from Wave 2, which is Trap Jaw, Evil, and Arm for Combat, and Manny Faces, Heroic Human, Robot, and Monster. And like the other two figures of Orko and Scareglow, they do come with the same comic book called Double Trouble. With some really great artwork. It also shows the back of all the figures in Wave 2. There you go, guys. So let's look at Manny Faces first. So let me put Trap Jaw off to the side. And there's old Manny Faces himself. A fan favorite. And a cool figure to have. So let's flip him around. And there's some beautiful artwork. Now, I believe in the Filmation cartoon, he was portrayed as an actor as well, besides being a, a hero. So there he is performing for King Randor and Queen Marlena with Tila and Orko in the background. And when he was a, when he was a hero, you can see him in his monster form taking on looks like Skeletor. And there is his call for his future. And basically all you had to do is just twist the knob up on the top of his head to either become a human, a robot, or a monster. And of course the rest of the figures in Wave 2. And I do have a loose version of him. And there he is. So this is that feature. Just twist the top, the knob right here, to either make him a robot or a monster. Back to a human. And this will twist from side to side, but you cannot remove it like any other figures so far I've, I've shown in my reviews. But you can remove the arms. Like so. They're all in a all in a ball, ball joint, and it snaps right back into place. You also can remove this part as well, and it snaps right back on. And there you go. He also comes with his standard uh, pistol. And his legs go up and down, side to side, a little twist action there. And there he is in the front right there. To the side of him. And back. And the other side. And coming later this year, we'll be getting his mini comic book version of him in Origins will have different face sculpts uh, not like the ones you see here from uh, his original should be coming out sometime in the fall and there you go guys there's Manny Faces now we're gonna move on to Trap Jaw one of my personal favorites in the line Vintage as well as Origins but there he is there's trap jaw, and we flip it around, and we can see some amazing artwork, as always, of him taking on He-Man and Ram-Man, and his call-out feature that he can switch uh, weapons on his arm, and store his other weapons on his belt. And you can also move his mouth up and down. And I do have a loose version of him as well. There he is. So you can, like, like I said, you can move his mouth up and down. You can. Now, I did not know this, but um, you can take this off. And I thought it was like one piece. I thought this whole thing was one piece and you couldn't remove it. But you can pop this off, this, this part right here. So 
And there's his weapons. You can pretty much store them on his belt right here. Like that. Also, he keeps that same feature from the from the original, from the OG line, or the vintage line, where you can put, like, a piece of string on, and through that little hole right there, you can have him, like, going down the rope, you know, scaling down Snake Mountain, or, like, uh, Castle Grayskull. But an amazing figure, guys. I'm gonna be able to stand them up. Ah, there we go. Cool. Now, not too long ago, we did get another version of uh, Trap Jaw, his mini comic book version, which I will show in a, right now. And I'll do a more deep dive of that figure. But here is his mini comic book version. I believe a part of Wave Eleven. So there you go. And I really I really do like this paint scheme they gave him for his mini comic book version. I really like that. And I'll show you the back. And like before, I will do a more uh, deep look and review on that wave when we hit that wave. And I will compare them again to the original trap jaw that came out in, during wave two. But there you go. A little sneak peek of a future trap jaw coming soon to the to YouTube for review. So there you go, guys. That's wave two. Uh, wave two was, like I said before in the last video, was very small. Only two. Uh, no, I'm sorry, only four figures that came out. Now, starting tomorrow, we'll be looking at uh, Wave 3. And Wave 3 was massive, guys. I I'm telling you, like, the we got four we got four figures, standard figures. We also uh, started getting the deluxe figures in Wave 3, like Battle Omer, uh, Skeletor and He-Man, uh, Clamp Champ, Deluxe Clamp Champ, uh, Deluxe Bram Man, and I think Mosquito and Hordak, boss, like Buzzsaw Hordak. We got two versions of Panther that came out. One flocked, one not flocked. Uh, Target um, finally got Origins in as well, because at that point, up to Wave 2, it was only a Walmart exclusive. So Target finally was able to get Origins figures, and they got some exclusives and stuff like that. Uh, they got their own vehicle and a uh, two-pack as well from Target. We'll be doing that. Uh, we also got another vehicle that was only exclusive to uh, Walmart. And, of course, uh, we got Castle Grayskull in Wave 3. And so tomorrow we'll be starting uh, Wave 3 with the, with the standard four figures. Uh, we'll probably be looking at uh, I'll show you all four figures. And then we'll do a deep dive on Merman and probably Zodak. So stay tuned to the uh, to the to the video. Uh, thank you guys once again for all my new subscribers, guys. It, it means a lot to me. This has been a lot of fun, and I hope to do more of these videos. So please like these videos, guys. Uh, comment on you know on the videos, guys. Let me know you know uh, who's your favorite He-Man figure. Or line stuff like that. Uh, please also hit that notification bell, guys, to let you know when I do upload videos. And I'm gonna try to upload a, a video, a new video every day, if I can. Um, so once again, guys, thank you so much for all my new subscribers. Thank you for liking the video. Uh, just hit that thumbs up. Uh, it means a lot. Uh, take care. Have a great weekend, guys. Um, I hope you have a great Friday, and. Take care.